Hi everybody. So here we are. I am going to, we are going to install a baby slash dog slash cat gate. So it's going to be a gate that's going to go from our banister to our door, uh, just temporarily until, uh, we figure out a different place to put it, but we're just going to uh, install it and it has a little cat door so that the cats can go in and out of it. So we're just going to put it together here and show you how it works. Hope everybody's doing good. It's Friday. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I didn't tell you. Hopefully this will be very simple. I'm thinking it will. Yeah, we did have Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Huh. Oh, it's heavy. I know, did we? Oh, oh Something geez. fell out. This is... Okay, so now we can get rid of the box. It's just a safety corner. I'm wearing my Timu sweater, which is very comfortable, but thin. And it does have pockets. So these are all your slides. So that's what the gate looks like. There's your kitty door. Just you slide it up. So it's not actually like a door. I mean, it is a door, but you just slide it up and they can go in and out. And this will keep the dogs from uh, going into our bedroom. We're probably going to put it upstairs, but I'm just doing it down here because it's just easier to film here. They treat our beds it's like a romp and a rumpus room. So these are side extensions. There's three different ones. So you can make it longer or shorter. I mean, it's not going to go shorter than this, obviously, but... Well, they do have different sizes. This is the extra long version. Yeah, I think they had two different sizes of this. Uh, you don't open this one yet until you install it. Oh. The belt before the installation is complete. Because this is going to tension itself into place. I'm not understanding. Well, it might be permanent. This will snap. So I'll have to put it back under tension again to remove oh. it. In order to remove it. Because once it goes into place, it's going to put high tension. And then we won't be able to use this bathroom. But it's okay because we're just gonna, we'll, we'll figure it out and then we'll put it upstairs. I'll just put a new zip tie on and then we'll take it apart. So we just put one piece, one extension piece on here. You want to turn it upside down? These are the adjustment legs for height, I believe. Uh, it, it, turn it around and check the height. That, I thought it was a leg, but it's not. Good command, don't read the instructions. Too I mean, yeah, right. we could right here. I don't think there are instructions. Did you see instructions? I didn't even look. Yeah, so one of the Y extenders would work right there. So this piece is for a banister. So we're going to put it right here on the banister. Right, here. Come on, buddy. Go on. The cat's in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> Well, try not to hit me in the head. Mm -hmm. Put these both on your side. Okay, up some. And you just wind those out until it's tight on each side, just like this. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna unsnap this because it's gonna put too much tension on our door. I don't want to break our door. So there's a button for your gate, but when it's in place, there's a heavy-duty zip tie. And when you cut this. It's going to put extra tension on it. Now, we're not going to leave this here permanently, so we don't want to do that. Right? But there's your kitty door. A lot of junk. There we go. Lock and unlock. A little kitty door comes oh, up. Let me see it lock. Let me see it lock. Okay, there's lock. Easy, Bell. Slide it up, turn the button. Then the kitty can go in and out. Bella, nice. Be nice. Here's Bella. Come okay. here, Tyson. Come here, Ty. Come here, Tyson. Come here. He's gonna trip over the cord. Yeah. Come on, Isabel, go. Okay, so. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. We'll lift it up over him. All it's right. always fun when the animals are all together. But all there's right. your gate. There's the gate. Voila. Oof. No okay. kitty. Now hopefully they come through this. And if you just walk it that way, you unlock it, it'll go down. Come here, Smoothie. Oh, did he? Did he? Oh, he did. Come here, bud. Come on. Okay, the dogs are getting rowdy now. Okay, so that is the gate. Tyson, so we're, we're just going to take five and then I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. So we just finished doing the uh, gate video, the doggy gate video. I'm going to put that in the description box below so that you can order that on Amazon. And there are two sizes. Again, it is a very nice gate. Uh, now we weren't able to actually open the door. The kitty door will open, but we weren't actually able to open the door because of the tension. 
Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah. We're not so. putting it there permanently. Right. And so it, wherever you put it permanently, you can cut that zip tie. And then it'll just lock into place. But Yeah, it shows uh, you on the box. It says that it'll possibly snap because it's under tension. Just going to show you real quick. It says do not remove zip tie because it's under tension. So yeah, we just took caution and didn't do it. So also, I wanted to let you know that it is, um, it is now after 3 o'clock. I did pick a winner for the giveaway, so that will be posted in my community feed. So make sure you go in the community feed and check it out to see if you are the winner. Uh, I think there were about 212 entries, 212 comments. So each comment, and it doesn't take double comments, so each comment is considered an entry. So we have that. Uh, I was trying to figure out what to do for the next video. I know I did get a lot of people saying that they wanted uh, a Dollar Tree haul. What else? A Shein haul. Shein. Somebody told me it was it was short for She Indoors, which I'm not sure. Shein, Shein, whatever. Maybe I'll do a haul for that. Uh, somebody else had said that maybe we can do like a get to know me type thing. So if you want in this video, uh, I thought it would be kind of cool to if there's any questions you you would like to ask us just comment you know comments below and then we can answer all of your questions in a separate video which i thought would be neat yeah they did give instructions oh. i just found them the yes here are the instructions them. the cat pulled up the cat was in the bag with the instruction booklet <laughs> you know i don't know if i'll be able to answer all of them but and one of these days we'll, we'll eventually do a live but you know if you have any questions i wish i could get to know all of you uh, maybe I'll try to figure that out how to do that sometime, but are curious about or you know, what's your favorite color or I don't know what other questions do people ask? Likes, dislikes. Yeah. Hobbies. What do you what are you most afraid of? Your hobbies, right. So things like that. So we we could what's do something like that. What's your favorite scary movie? What's your favorite food? What's your favorite funny movie? What's yeah. your favorite Christmas movie? Right, anything like that. So we can answer those for you. And then maybe comments, you can, you know, once I answer yours, you can also just comment um, your answer Which to your question. Which pet is the most well-behaved? <laughs> Which pet is the most well-behaved? Probably Coco, because she stays upstairs all the time. We really never see her much. Carpet Karen hides upstairs. It's her room. So, <clears throat> yeah, so definitely check out the uh, community tab. If you don't know where to find it, it's just on my page and there will be uh, like a bar that will show videos, shorts, playlists, community. And there might be more, I'm not sure. So there is that. What else did I want to tell you? Oh, I wanted to give a shout out to um, a woman that has been commenting on a lot of my videos. Uh, Deborah. Her name is Deborah Whitney. She seems like a very sweet woman. I went over to her channel and checked her out. Uh, she seems very sweet. So I wanted to say hi to her. Hi, Deborah. Hi, Deborah. Uh, who else? There are so many people that I'd like to give shout outs to. I, I gave some shout outs yesterday, but uh, who else? All my Karens, my Mary Jo, who else? I'm just gonna have to write them down because I always forget. My mama bear, my, there's another mama goose, I think. <laughs> there's, there's a lot and there's a lot of doubles. So I get kind of confused. The Terry's, there's two Terry's, one with an I, one with a Y. Leslie, yeah, there's a lot, but I'll just have to maybe go through and because there's so much to remember. And this, this is kind of oh, this video was kind of just spur of the moment type video before we have to go to work here. I have to go to work. He has to go bid on a job. So there is that. Happy Friday. Yeah, happy Friday. And maybe maybe tomorrow I'll try to do a video on my junk journaling so I can show you. I showed you everything that I got. I have it over here. That's why I'm pointing this way. But I, I showed you everything that I hauled in the junk journal video, but maybe tomorrow I'll do a little tu tutorial if anybody's interested in how to actually put it together. Uh, and what I'm gonna use is a, I think it's like a tuna helper or hamburger helper box. So you can use cereal boxes, cracker boxes. Uh, some people use books and then they cut out like hardback books and then they cut out the, the pages on the inside. You can do that. So I'll probably do a junk journaling video tomorrow because I don't think I have any Timu hauls coming or I know I have a couple jewelry uh, items coming in the mail. One should be coming tomorrow 
hopefully today, but we'll see what else. I'm trying to think of what else I have coming. I think that might be it. So I know this is going to be a short video, and if you've watched, I, I really appreciate you. I know I talked about doing the gate video the other day. So if you did watch the gate video, I appreciate it. Hope you have a very good weekend. And if you could please like, subscribe, comment, make sure in this video that you comment your questions for us though. So don't forget about that. And then we'll just do that in another video. I hope you have a good weekend and we will talk to you soon. Thank you, stay sweet.